unable to make bootable USB stick from ISO. I'm trying to use the Windows 7 USB slash DVD download tool from the Microsoft Store to make my new 16 GB USB flash drive bootable to install Windows. It worked the first time that I did this, for Windows 7 Pro 32 bit, but now it keeps failing at the end. I'm trying to make it bootable with the Windows 7 Pro 64-bit installation DVD ISO. I've tried to do this on two different computers, Windows XP Pro 32-bit and AMP, Windows 7 Pro 32-bit, with the same error. Files copied successfully. However, we were unable to run BootSec to make the USB device bootable. If you need assistance with BootSec, please click the online help link above for more information. Clicking the link just takes me to the Microsoft Store homepage, and a search for BootSec from there yields no search results. I've tried to burn a DVD twice using Sonic Record now, but even though it finishes without errors, the disk is unreadable. Frown does anyone know why this keeps failing and how I may fix it? It would seem that BootSect was failing because the device was already bootable. This morning I decided to try using it to boot with the Windows 7 Professional 64-bit installer image loaded on it, despite the failure, just to see what would happen. Surprise surprise, it worked. Underscore. Warning. This will erase all data on this USB stick. Launch a command prompt with admin rights and run the disk part tool. The list disk command will show you the connected drives and with select disk, you can choose your USB stick. Be careful to select the right drive or else your day won't have a happy end. The crucial step here is the clean command. It overwrites the MBR in the partition table, thereby deleting everything on the stick. The following description is taken from the tools online help. When creating a bootable USB device, I am getting an error about boot sect. To make the USB device bootable, you need to run a tool named bootsect.x. In some cases, this tool needs to be downloaded from your Microsoft Store account. This may happen if you're trying to create a 64-bit bootable USB device from a 32-bit version of Windows. To download Bootsect, log in to your Microsoft Store account to view your purchase history. Look for your Windows 7 purchase. Next to Windows 7, there is an additional Download Options drop-down menu. In the drop-down menu, select 32-bit ISO. Right-click the link and then save the bootsect.x file to the location where you installed the Windows 7 USB slash DVD download tool, for example, percent user profile percent backslash updater backslash local backslash apps backslash Windows 7 USB DVD download tool. Once the file has been saved, go back to the Windows 7 USB slash DVD download tool to create your bootable USB device. Archive.org link, this URL. Update, it might be enough to just check out fixes for old biases while keeping the default MBR partition scheme. I had this issue when trying to create a bootable Windows 7 USB stick for an older laptop, ThinkPad T410. Even with this warning, it still should boot as far as I understand, 
but the reason it didn't for me was because I had an older BIOS, so what I ended up doing was using the Rufus USB tool with the following settings. Notice the partition scheme and target system. I guess the Windows USB tool assumes UFI and uses the wrong partition scheme? I don't really know, but this worked for me. If you want to support the channel, please consider subscribing.